This is a potion that will wipe out the human race. Just one drop can turn a child into a mouse. The Supreme is as strong as a bull, talking excitedly about his plans for the removal of human children. The witches are on fire, clapping his hands with three fingers. Suddenly he shouted. Then he opened his 20 centimeter nostrils and began to sniff. He smelled a child. He hated the smell. Get your position. He immediately lifted the table. There's nothing down there. He locked the vents one step at a time. Then the door knocks. It was Xia Xin who came in and asked them for chocolate. The witches returned to their ladylike dress in a second. The Supreme triumphantly took shape as a lesson. Show the other witches the power of their potion. Sure enough, the little body that ate the chocolate kept twitching. Smoke rose from the seven shafts and a catapult flew into the air. Only the clothes were floating on the ground. Then, a little mouse came staggering out of his coat. The test was successful. A bunch of witches came at him. He unleashed a high-heeled assault. Tintin's pet white comes forward. I'm gonna drag him to the vent. However, Tintin was exposed. The witch grabbed him by the ears and pulled him out. When he presses it on the ground, he shall give him medicine. Though he was determined not to open his mouth, but the witch drifted into his ear. In the excited shrieks of the witches, Tintin's eyes turned white and his nose and ears were smoking, bubbling purple all over. Soon only the clothes fell slowly to the ground. He turned into a mouse. Anne staggered out. When she saw the witch run, the witch seized him by the tail. I see witches trying to hammer Tintin. Haku rushed out at once, biting into his hand. The witch hit her hand hard with a hammer. The angry witch pursued them with her varied talons. But the high-speed fan got in the way. In the midst of life and death, their tiny weight opened a deep tunnel. <laughs>